I'm Willy Christensen. I'm a professor at the Fisheries Center of the University of British Columbia. And I'm also director of a new research activity. It's called the NERIOS program, predicting the future ocean. And the purpose is really to answer the question, would it be life in the ocean for our children and grandchildren to enjoy? What we're trying to do is to make a simulator of life in the oceans that's realistic. So we're using this interplay between the science and communication to impact policy makers and also to inform the public. I'm Daniel Pauli. I'm a professor of fisheries here at uh, the Fisheries Center. I'm a principal investigator of the CRRS project, a big project uh, aimed at assessing the impact of fisheries on, on two ecosystems. And uh, marine biodiversity, it means it means all the animals and plants that live in the sea um, are threatened by the existence and the way we perform fisheries. This um, destruction, because that's what it is, um, doesn't have to be. Uh, you can fish uh, while maintaining biodiversity. Fundraising is a challenge. The project I do has to be funded from external sources. UBC as a whole has been a, a marvelous host for the Sea Runners project. They have been very supportive and have recognized the work of the Sea Runners and of the, of the Fishery Center in a way that makes us uh, very proud. The Nippon Foundation came to the Fishery Center and they came because they wanted to start activities on capacity building and capacity building is a major reason why we're here. And it's research that has given us our name, really, and that's what attracts good students. It has been a big challenge to continue to raise funds for this. We are the only group that works with the future of the oceans. What happens to fish, fisheries, how will it be in the future? Our research is totally dependent on project funding. That's what keeps our research group going, and we are asking big questions that will have implications for millions of people around the world. 